Brian. Thanks very much indeed, Eamon. Finally, this evening, President McAleese has opened a trail in County Leitrim, which is dedicated to the English novelist Anthony Trollope. Sent to the village of Drumsna to investigate allegations of embezzlement in the local post office, Trollope was inspired to write his novel, The McDermott's of Ballycloran. She was welcomed by the future of Drumsna and then stepped back into the town's past. President Mary McAleese was entertained by characters from Anthony Trollope's first novel, The McDermott's of Ballycloran, inspired by his time here in the 1800s. Something really happened in a sense to his soul here and something happened that opened him up to his own genius. And I think Drumsna is entitled to take um, great, tremendous, um, tremendous pride in that. And they do. The community has now created an Anthony Trollope trail. There are 15 stops on the trail, all associated with Anthony Trollope's time in Drumsna. It'll take you just over an hour to walk it, but this is a far nicer way to see it. Originally, he came here to investigate uh, a shortfall of money in the post office. He passed the time and that he went for long strolls and walks and he came this road here which was beautiful, still is. He got the inspiration that he should write a novel. So he wrote his first novel there which was entitled The McDermott's of Ballyclarn. A lot of people who call to them now, tourists and people who pass and, and that, they inquired where Anthony Trollope stayed, where was Ballyclarn Castle. And there was so much interest, well, it gave the locals an inspiration that we should do something about it and put it on the map. A map they now hope many Trollope fans will 